Time for our Tail Wagger of the Week, and Glenn is the Tail Wagger of the Week. Kelly Barris from the Fox Valley Humane Association joins me to tell us about, there he is, Glenn. Hi, Kelly. Hi, how are you? So, how'd you find this guy? He actually came to us as a stray. He's a sweet, sweet little uh, toy poodle um, named Glenn, and um, he does great with other animals. Um, he, he's not afraid of the big dogs. He likes the little ones and the big ones. He's, really, he's a really good lap dog. He traveled well on the way here. Um, he's a cuddler. He's just an all-around great dog. Um, no small, small children, because if you move too fast, he's like, whoa, uh -huh. <laughs> what was that? But um, older children that you know are gentle with him and will play gentle would be great for him. Now so. he's got a tag on? What's he got a tag on for then? Um, I think that must be his... Oh, that's just saying that he came from us in case he ran away while he was oh, okay. on a walk. We put the tags on him to make sure, you know, just in case, because it has happened, sure. <laughs> that we get them back. So and th this guy is going to make somebody a great um, uh, lap pet, right? Yes, yes, great companion. Yeah. So. Um, you know, you uh, have something going on tonight that a lot of animal lovers w would like to go to, especially if they have the older animals, right? Yes, yes. Um, it's our um, class. It's free. It's tonight at 6 p.m. It's called um, Understanding End-of-Life Care for Your Pet, and it's put on by um, the Healing Heart Foundation. It'll be taught by Val Adams. It's a lot of, um, it's informal question and answer, teaching, just a, giving you options, telling you what to look for. It's a really informational class, and it's stuff that, you know, is not common knowledge for pets that are older. Just so. show up then? Yep. Yep, anytime um, around, we'll be there, we'll be open before 6, so you can come anytime, and then the class starts at 6. Kelly, one last thing, uh, the grooming of somebody like uh, Glenn, do you have to groom him a lot? Yeah, probably every 8 to 10 weeks, okay. um, he'd need grooming, and probably at least weekly brushing, if not daily, so. All right. Yeah. Well, Kelly, thank you very much, and Glenn, thank you. We're going to get you to a great home, and if you want to adopt Glenn, all you have to do is call 733-1717. Go to foxvalleypets.org for more information um, or go to our website and we have more information or have a link to theirs on our website. You're watching Good Day Wisconsin. We'll be right back.